Okay, so day two, we're going to do the alternate route, a little bit lower elevation, so this is the Jarvis Mountain. I think it's going to be just as nice of a hike. We'll go right below the biggest peaks, so it should look pretty sweet. Abdomen on her. The fuck is that? All right, we're about to. Uh, I don't know if you can see Joel over there. This is this is our trail. And it's about the rain. Six more miles. I hope you're capturing the misery. <laughs> it's beautiful out here. How you feeling, Carmen? He's speechless. It's so beautiful out here. He's speechless. So we're up here on a pack trail. There's an old mine. I don't think anyone's been on this trail for about a hundred years because there's really not much left. But it's been packed down by the donkeys and stuff for when they were mining. So, so far so good. Thunderstorm's coming in. But we're just going to keep on hiking. Check this out. This is cool. Oh. White tail, dope. And so we successfully went around the mountains and the snow. Carmen's gonna be happy about this. Carmen found a road. Behind us is the Oahe Desert. You can see Jarbage Canyon. And that's where we're going. We're gonna stay on the east side, so that's my, to the right there. Stay on that rim for about 100 miles, so ham it. And the desert section is about to begin. We're almost over the Jarbage Mountains. This is one of the highest points we'll, we'll be on. And so we'll just keep on going. Finally made it down out of the mountains. Well, almost. Almost. Into the canyon. <laughs> but follow this trail until our first water supply make camp. So you have these mountains and then you have this valley. And then it just goes into this canyon. 
it's it's like another planet okay so we're coming down this canyon pretty hard and we're, we're still going I think we're, we're gonna lose multiple thousands of feet of elevation this is a really steep canyon and it just keeps on going but wow magnificent we are on the east side of the east branch of the Jarbage River or inside the canyon right now we're walking north towards Idaho we have to cross over into the actual canyon today and then uh, get on up and we'll make camp at the border we have a water drop waiting for us there And so there's been a landslide here in the canyon and uh, the trail goes up this. And here's the border of the wilderness. coming down an elevation out of the Jarbage Mountains to the border of Idaho. Ow! Ow, it really hurts. It's fucking coming down hard as fuck. Ah. Right now we're camped at the first water drop for the desert. Um, we'll be riding 20 miles tomorrow. That's uh, ten and a half miles. Oh, hell yeah, dude! I gotta take this off for a minute. Yeah. How long? Am, how far behind you am I? Half an hour. Uh, about twenty-five minutes. All right.
Oh, I'm not sleep on couch yet, but that's yeah. easier said than done. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Can't believe I carried that platypus the whole way. Platypus? Yeah. Thank you. I carried this fucking five gallon thing. Two and a half gallon. I don't think we have to do that tomorrow. Ah. Oh. We got water. Oh yeah, dude. Ah. Ah. Still see a mountain over there, snow covered. That's garbage. Wow. Yesterday, we woke up and it was still raining. It was still raining. It rained till 10 a.m. Yeah. Well, it rained till noon. It rained till noon, yeah. Yeah. And we decided to just pack up and keep going, but then the trail was basically just mud. Dude, it's terrible. It's like I have bricks on my feet. It doesn't come off either. It adds like a couple pounds to the shoes. Oh. God. And it was like a type of mud that I've never seen. It caked up on the bottom of my shoes? Or yeah. yours too, just inches. I, I think it was a mix of like the manure from the cows and, cause it's like years and years of manure on this road, melting into the road. We can see all the, all the we cakes. All the cakes. <laughs> and, and then, and then this, this, this rain comes, which it's the desert. So I think this is like the only time it even rains. Horny toad. These things will shoot blood out of their eyes. Oh. Whoa. Oh, it's shedding its skin too. Look at this. They really only come out when there's water. So it's kind of a cool experience to see them in the desert like this. Look at them.
Yeah, so uh, Joel basically, he went fishing about, I don't know, about a half hour, hour ago. And I went looking for him. I, I can't find him. Joel! Uh, he should be back, but I mean, it, it, it could be raining soon. And Yo, go right Joel! Ahead. Yo! Yo, you hungry? <laughs> Whoa! You found some. Yeah. yeah, we're having we're having chub for dinner. When's All the last right. time we had meat? About what? I don't know, four or five days ago? Six. Six days ago. Six days. Without wow. meat. Tonight we feast. Getting some water to boil, start a fire. Trying to feed us. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh. That water going around? Yeah. Let me lighten your load. Please. Oh man. That's a good way to do it. Just kind of bend it. Keep it open, but bend it. Yeah. That looks like where that front's coming in from. Yeah. It's a good thing we brought our own water, because I do not want to drink that. That's foul. Yeah. After all this rain, too, you'd think there'd be more in it. Yeah.
definitely another uh, 1900 and change. Yeah, 1900 and change.